right. Put it straight there. Lovely. I'm at LASIK Expert, so I'm finally pulling the trigger. I've been talking to you guys a lot about finally doing LASIK, and I'm doing it next week. So um, I'm going to take you guys along with me and share my experience, and hopefully it goes well. I want you guys to meet the crew that's going to take care of me. So this is Vanessa, Rebecca, Jess, and Dr. Cook. My eyes are super dilated. I'm doing it. I scheduled my appointment for next week, and I'm finally doing it. If I literally have wanted this done for so long and it's just, oh my God, I really can't see. I've wanted it done for so long, but it's very expensive. And I was really worried that in med school, it would mess with my ability to like study. I wasn't sure going in today that I was actually gonna like book and follow through, but I just like got a really good vibe from the office and the staff and they were all really nice and we're doing it. So we're doing it. And I can't wait to not wear glasses or contacts. Yay. So excited. I'm literally the most excited about to be able to see in the shower. That's really weird, but I haven't able to, been able to do that since I was like 10. And I also want to be able to like play on TikTok at night and not have this situation going on with like the pillow. I need glasses wearers know exactly what I'm talking about. All right, I'm like, wow, I'm so excited. Okay, I'll see you guys next week and we're gonna have new eyes. My dad's praying for me. Did you pray for me? Oh. Thanks. So my dad prayed for me so I don't go blind. <laughs> Just kidding. I was kind of nervous. Kind of not. Okay, so we're going to head to the surgery. I got my things. Got my eye drops. I'm scared. Okay, bye. Well, we're gonna sit down with At the stop sign, turn right onto East Robinson. Thanks, Dad. Then turn left onto I, I've been wearing glasses since, what, like, three months? Yeah, three months. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, Dad. Yeah, thanks, Dad. Thanks, Dad. Yeah, 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 I don't know what that has to do with Tata. I've been wearing glasses since like fourth grade, I think. And then I started wearing contacts in like seventh grade. And then I've been wearing contacts basically my whole life until I got into med school. And then my glasses, my eyes just started rejecting the contacts. Like apparently it was developing an allergic reaction to the contact lenses. I switched like many different brands. I switched many, many different types, didn't ever fix it. So then I decided that I was gonna do LASIK and then I went two years ago and I had a consultation and they told me it was $5,000 and I can't afford that. So I was like all ready to get it done and then I, I don't, I don't know, I was under the impression that it'd be not that expensive and then it was. So then I was like, okay, I'll wait until like a smarter time to get it done. I've been like saving up basically since I found out it was so expensive and trying not to spend any money. And today's the day, we're gonna get it done. So- Inshallah, inshallah she would be good. Yeah, high five. High five. Uh... <laughs> okay, bye guys. So I'm just getting checked in, I just paid, and then we're getting checked in over here and getting everything set. Just to... We're going in soon. And whenever you're ready, Okay. Are you comfortable? Yep. Give me a couple breaks. Yeah. Yeah. You place that over your head. Okie dokie. So, you have glasses, sleeping shields, and then tape. Okay. So, if you don't mind, can you put the tape on your collar for me? There we go. So, thank you. You ready for me, huh? Ready. All right. Hello, young lady. Hello. How are you? I'm Dr. Dave. Here. Hi, Dr. Dave. How are you? Good. Nice, nice to meet, to meet you. you. Okay, I'm just going to quadruple check this the prescription, yeah, just, okay? Just so you know, there's a camera recording. I'm vlogging this experience. Are you comfortable with that? Oh, I'm fine. Okay. Yeah. Just making yeah. sure. It's my first YouTube experience. It is. I'm really YouTube famous. You can just play with the camera if you want to. Okay, okay. so we're going to just double check here, okay? So we'll take this. All right. All right. Let's take a little peek. Let's get this done. Yep. Okay. <laughs> Looking straight ahead. Can you make out the letters up there? L-F-L-C-T. And small I. A-P-E-O-T-S. Better or worse if I do that. They're so nice here. Oh my God, they're so nice. Yeah, you talk about so many people are afraid to get this done. I always want to discuss the reality with a patient. Mm -hmm. You know, the reality is if you're a contact lens wearer, mm -hmm. um, you're most likely abusing your eyes with those contacts. Mm -hmm. I was in medical school, mm -hmm. right? I wore them for 18 hours a day. Right. Sometimes you slept in them yeah. and whatnot. And your eyes aren't meant to have a form object in them right. uh, day in, day out. Mm -hmm. So risk. And better one or two? Mm -hmm. One, two, two. Yeah. Good. Okay. Um, all right, give me a minute. I'm going to calibrate the laser. Perfect. And uh, I'll bring you right in. Hey, 
Is that astigmatism something that gets corrected with the laser? It is. So, uh, you know, you get in Contoro, mm -hmm. which is the latest in laser technology to mm -hmm. correct all these aberrations in your eyes, astigmatism, any topographic abnormalities, things like that. Yeah. So overall, your potential for being 2020 or even better are extremely high. Cool. So ultimately, you still got you have to heal, course, stabilize. Yeah. But you know, technology is pretty darn cool now. Yeah. That, you know, we can be a lot more precise. Awesome. So, um, all right, give me a few minutes. Cool. I'll, I'll bring you right in. Perfect. So I just woke up and yesterday when I got home from the surgery, it was about four-ish hours of like really intense pain and like tearing up and it was like super uncomfortable. And then it was just like blurry. So I went to sleep when my vision was still blurry, but the doctors told me that I should wake up with like perfect vision. So I'm like still afraid to open my eyes clearly. So let's get up. <laughs> oh my God. Things I put on the internet, huh? I'm gonna open the shade a little bit. Oh god, that's really bright. Okay. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, did my eyebrow just fall? Ow. Oh my god. look new they're brand new guys i paid a lot of money for them i don't know if it's the new eyes or the covid vaccine that's in my arm but i'm just ready to go places like i just want i want to book all these trips and i want to buy all these outfits and i'm just like ready to make 2021 way updates very sensitive to light i have to keep sunglasses on i'm not allowed to wear makeup for a week and it's like every hour things are getting clearer and clearer. Like it's still a little bit blurry, 
but like it just every time I think it's like the clearest, it gets clearer, which is expected. So you see this? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so we're going out on an adventure. Um, just because we're bored. All right, say bye. It's post-op day four. And yesterday and today, I'm having a lot of issues with my eyes. My left eye is blurry. And today, my right eye feels like it has something in it all day. And I just had an interview. I just literally had um, a residency interview and I couldn't see out of my right eye. I have my last follow-up appointment on Saturday. And I hope it doesn't stay like this because it's like very uncomfortable. Like I just like wanna rip it out of my eye but there's nothing in my eye to rip out because it's just my eyeball now <laughs> it was going great but now it's not i like didn't want to record it yesterday because i was like maybe it'll just go away but it's definitely still there and now it's my right eye they told me that it was going to change for like a week but i don't know we'll see all right I'm dr shaw i'm here <laughs> i'm here with my star patient <laughs> Hey guys. Uh -huh. <laughs> Doing great. So we're gonna check, we're gonna see how she did. She had LASIK done uh, a week ago. Yep. And let's see how she's doing today. We're gonna check her on the eye chart across the room. Num the letters get pretty small, but let's see. All right, so we'll go ahead and look uh, straight ahead. Yep. Can you read that please? E-G-N-D-H. Okay. O-F-L-C-T-Z. Awesome, now we're gonna get pretty small there. Let's see if you can keep going. A-P-E-O-T-F. Awesome, now we're gonna get to 2020, see if you can see that. T-Z-B-E-C-L. Wow, it's pretty good, <laughs> 2020, but let's push her. All right, O-N-P-N-T-Z. 2015, all right. <laughs> Is it even worth going to 2010? Because who really cares at that point, but let's try it. All right, uh, E-T-O. Wow. Last letter's an F. All right, that, that is, Technically, Eagle Vision, she's at 2010. So that's okay, pretty good a week out. Yep. Um, and let me actually now, let's just make sure you're, you're healing well, your cornea as well. Mm -hmm. Let's do a slit lamp exam. Perfect. Take a look, good. So we're checking basically to make sure that the flaps are well healed. There's no movement there. She didn't rub her eyes. There's no striae. There's no DLK. There's no signs of infection, no scarring, and it looks great there. And awesome, flaps look beautiful there. So that's it. So, so you should be having great functional vision overall. Mm -hmm. uh, and the only restriction I tell patients is no eye rubbing aggressive. It's not good for you anyway, whether you right. did this procedure or not. I don't like rubbing eyes. Yep. Um, but outside of that, that's it. I cool. mean, you're fully functional, go enjoy life. Awesome, uh, well, I'm gonna do another week follow up. So I'm still having a little bit of dryness. So we're gonna do one more week and then I'll update you guys. And yeah, if you guys have any questions, ask me, ask, I'm sure email Dr. Anytime. Shaw. Yep, we'll leave a link or something yep. below. But yeah, absolutely, any questions, you guys can email or, or call and happy to help. Awesome, all right, thank you. Okay guys, so I am officially three months post-op from my LASIK eye surgery and I wanna share like my final, final, final thoughts. If you are someone who has been wearing contacts or glasses and you're starting to become irritated and you've been thinking about LASIK, but you're not sure if you wanna do it because of all the risks and all that, it's all, it's scary. Like, I highly recommend doing this procedure. Like all of the discomfort that I had for like, you know, the beginning week or any blurriness or any of the like weird feelings that I shared through this like experience, everything has resolved. The only thing that's kind of still there is every once in a while I get dry eyes, um, but that's like remedied just by putting in an eye drop. Um, it's usually like no problem most days, but like on very, very dry days. Or if I'm just like breathing um, with my face mask, like if my face mask is here and I like breathe into my eyes, I think it be becomes a little bit irritated. Other than that, alhamdulillah, I've had no issues. Um, my vision is crystal clear. I'm recommending this place that I got it done at, this LASIK expert place by Dr. Shah. I'm gonna put their information here. So I, you know, went into this and I said, if I have a great experience, I'm gonna share it with you guys and like recommend it. And I can't, I, I mean, I really can't recommend it highly enough. Like they were really professional, really great. Like I just felt like everyone actually triple checked and everyone actually cared about me and my vision. Yeah, their information will be in the box below. He was really awesome. He was really cool. Tell him I say hi if you see him. And yeah, so alhamdulillah, he said 2010 in one of my eyes, 2015, better than 2020. I'm seeing great. I'm loving life. Everything's great, alhamdulillah. I've been organizing things because I start residency very, very soon. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Let me know if you have questions specifically about the LASIK or what my experience was. I'll answer as honestly and openly as I can. Alrighty, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.